Hello everyone, Neil from Merchant Former here. Today I want to do a video on an update we just pushed, the Merchant Former Lister. And this is going to be a smaller update, but it's going to save you a lot of time. I'm going to show you how it works right now. So once you install the Lister, you can click on the icon in the upper right hand corner and then it will bring you to this page. Now, if you're not familiar with this, this is going to help you list your products on Merch by Amazon a lot faster. As you can see here, I have some test products all set up, ready to go. Before you do that, you want to set up all your profiles. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come in here and I'm gonna make an info profile. So for a brand name, I'm gonna enter Merchant Former. Title of the product, we will just do Merchant Former T-shirt. Gonna make this really simple, guys. $16.99. We'll do Merchant Former bullet number one, if I could spell correctly. And then we will do Merchant Former bullet number two. Of course, with a space. And then for the product description, these are optional. I am going to fill this out real quick just to show you how it works. And we will make that a bit longer. There we go. Now, we will, you can set a hotkey for every profile. We're just going to make this really simple. Do Shift 1. So we want to set this to active and we are done. So when we go into our listing and we're going through and we hit shift one on our, on our information, when you fill out the brand title bullet points, it's automatically going to put all this information into your listing. Now, after you've done this, you want to come to color profiles and add a color profile. So I'm just going to call this dark colors. You can set a price here as well. We're going to set the same price we did before. And I typically pick, you know, the, the dark colors that look well together. We'll do slate and navy, black, heather blue, and dark heather. We're going to set a hotkey to shift two, and we'll click active. Actually, let's do this. Let's make this shift one. Sorry about that, shift one. And we will come back and we'll edit this one and we'll change this to shift two. All right, so as you see, we've set this up. We've picked men, women, youth. We have dark colors, a price, and a hotkey. So when we're going through the listing process, if you hit shift one, it's going to automatically fill out your colors, men, women, and youth. And then it is, you can click next. Now what we did add to speed up the process here is next info profile and next keyword spinner. Now what this is going to do, if you pick this one, so we have shift one set up here, or rather shift two, sorry about that. What this is going to do is, if we click done here, if we can go back and edit it, after you hit shift one, it is automatically going to go to the next page and fill out the info profile that we did previously. So it's going to enter these dark colors, it's gonna do the fit men, women, and youth at 1699, and it's automatically going to go to your info profile and fill this out on the next page. So I'm going to show you how that works now. This is shift two. This is shift one. So we'll come over here. We're just going to hit shift one. It's going to automatically go to the next two pages. So shift one, it fills it out, goes to the next page, and this page is already filled out with your info profile here. Now, if you want to spin different keywords into your listing here, if you go back to color profiles and you click edit, that's what this is going to be right here. You have to go to your keyword spinner. If you don't know how this works, there is a link here which will open up a YouTube video, but you can add a keyword spinner profile here. We're gonna call it Merchant Former Spinner. All right, so the placeholder here, we will make one and two. And a keyword, I'm just going to do dog and cat as an example, and we will make this shift three, and we'll make that active. Uh, oops, sorry about that. One and two, dog and cat, shift three, we'll make it active. Now, if you put these one and two with the brackets into your info profile, I will show you how to do that. You can just click edit. Now, what I've done is I put one and two here already. Here's one and two done 
All right, so let me show you how the keyword spinner works. Now, we've gone in here again, and we've added you know, keywords one and two, dog and cat, and we've added a hotkey for shift three. This allows you to spin different keywords into your listing. So we see that this is active. In our info profile here, we've gone ahead and added the placeholders, one and two. Remember, they do need to be in the brackets because the brackets are right here. So we simply put the brackets into our info profile. So to show you how this works, this is a shift two. Let me uh, go through save selection here. Now we will just click shift two and it will fill out this profile right here. So we still have the placeholders one and two. If we go back, the keyword spinner has a shift three. Now if we do shift three, it's automatically gonna fill in that one and two with dog and cat. So that's just to show you how you can spin keywords into your listing. Now, with the inclusion of what we just added here, if you go to the color profiles, you can actually pick one of these from the color profiles and click done. And what this is going to do is if you go to a brand new listing like this, remember we hit shift one, or rather shift one for the color profile, it's gonna to go to the info profile, shift two, and then finally shift three for the keyword spinner all automatically and i'll show you how that works right now so let's unpick some colors because we've done that already on this page so you hit shift one going to go to the next page fill out the information and as you see the keywords are spun in there automatically all you have to do is hit save selection and continue now let me just go to something that we have already open here see one of the best parts about this lister is it actually works on both marketplaces UK and Germany outside of the US. So as you can see, we'll do the UK here. Shift one, it'll fill everything out. It'll go to the next page. It'll fill everything out. Again, it'll spin the keywords in, save selection and continue. And you can list your product from here. Super, super easy. And it's going to save you a ton of time just automatically going through the pages, allowing you again to check everything, do your merchant former trademark checks, make sure everything looks good to go. And then you just simply click submit and you have more products up on Merch by Amazon than ever before. If you guys have any questions or concerns, make sure to drop them in the comments below. Like this video and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks.